Hi guys and welcome back. Today I'm going to be doing a really fun video with you guys. I figured I would do a shop with me video. I know I do a ton of hauls where I shut down, shut down, sit down and show you what I got. But I wanted to show you guys kind of the whole experience and I wanted to bring you guys shopping with me. Uh, I'm going to be going to Zara today. I figured it was a really good option to show you guys. I've, if you guys know, Zara does have a ton of really trendy stuff for a lot less. Like they have so many pieces that are super, super trendy and super in style and that are like originally priced super high and they have them for a lot less um and i still think zara is pretty good quality like probably one of the top like highest quality for especially for how much they are so i figured i would bring you with and my mom is actually here too so if any of you guys watch her on the vlog channel she's gonna be here um i normally would order online but i wanted to go in store i wanted to shop with you guys i wanted to show you guys everything that i'm looking at and then i want to try everything on with you guys any other stores that you'd like me to do this for i'm trying to think of like it's hard for, i don't know what other stores i have that are like state like standstill stores i guess if that makes sense like in a mall i could bring you with me a lot of the places i get stuff at are like just basically boutiques and stuff online get a little hydrated let's go do this i'm gonna try to give myself one hour and let's get this so we're in zara uh, animal print has been really big and my mom's even talking about it like there's so much animal print look at her outfit she's wearing little prada shoes like so cute with your little bag you look good <laughs> um but I'm just so there's so much animal print is what I'm noticing. I like really simple blouses like this Like I really like this like I like kind of like basics I'm just stacking them like I like with it. I'm gonna get there with it though. I love with the key tops But I want to get see if there's another fresher one that one looks like someone tried it on this one's good this one or this one Medium Duh Small. Let's see what other sizes there are in this. I don't even feel like I need to really try this one on because I know it's gonna fit. This is a small. No medium. Small. Perfect. Like this is like a white. I'm gonna show you what it looks like just like this. Like a white blouse. Obviously, I'd I'd unbutton this button. But this it's like it's casual. You'd wear it with like You'd, you can wear spot talk in English. You'd wear it, you'd like tuck it into jeans, the front. Like, you know how I do that, but you don't like that? Oh, this is kind of nice. The black, oh, look at this. I like this a lot too, it's like simple. Oh, I love those. I, 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 don't, I need a tight band so we can actually with somebody wear them. But they might be like loose, maybe a mean shit. And you see their pants are really loose, I've noticed. I don't know if you noticed that. All their pants are always so loose. That's the thing. But like for their for the size they're kind of small I should say. Kinda wanna try on these jeans, skinny jeans. What size are these? 36, 38, 38. 42. This might be a little. Let's try. I want to have like try this gray wash pant on. It's kind of like an interesting color. They look like a jegging, and they're 50, so if they fit well. They're 50, and like I like the cutoff. We'll try this one. Going forward. Let's see here. I like. I like. This is so cute. I think it's like too loose. I like that though. I'd do over. I'd wear it like oversized. Matcha. We have our cocoa. You want a matcha? No. No. Oh, my baby. Um, I wanted to do a haul of stuff I got. Um, as you saw, I was filming the shop with me. You're technically not allowed to film in Zara, so I had to be pretty sneaky about it. Also, feel free to leave in the comments any other stores you wanted me to do a shop with me. I was thinking Victoria's Secret. It's a little bit more niche because it'd be like sleepwear and bras and things like that. Um, but like the only thing is like trying, I could try on like sleepwear and things, but I don't know how I feel about trying on bras, you know, like. I'm pretty open, but I think my video would get flagged. It's funny because like a bikini haul is the same thing, but those don't get flagged. But if I did like a lingerie haul, like, you know, there'd be a little flagging flag. 
I make matcha. It's a little messy to make ice matcha. I should have put it in like a mason jar with the lid and shook it and then poured it in to make it look nice so it wouldn't have like all this residue. But I just put them in like wine glasses because it just makes it more fun <laughs> for me. Especially because I've been working work from home and so I like have it on my desk. It's a little treat. It's a nice little caffeine kick at like two. I and mean, it just tastes so good. Mmm. I highly recommend you get some wine glasses. These are from Amazon. Why do I go on all these tangents? But let's show you something I got from Zara. I think right now Zara has one of the best like collections out ever. Usually when I go, I find probably five things I like and I pick up like two or three out of the five. This time I like when I, I went and tried in like so tried on a lot of stuff. Some stuff I could immediately tell I didn't like and a lot of it I like. Like I got quite a bit of stuff honestly like a pretty big bag and I wasn't expecting to get that much stuff but I'm really excited I can get that much stuff because I can share with you guys that if you're interested you can head to Zara um I really really like Zara because it's just like it's like trendy it's like has really trendy stuff also really classy stuff and the quality is really good I think for the prices and so I wanted to share everything I'm so excited to go through everything and I'll think about off the top of my head the things that didn't work out and I can insert me trying them on some were really bad that I was like I cannot even film them like putting this on I just looked like whoa the the gray jeans were really nice and fit well they're just sitting at my hips and I like jeans to be high waisted because I'm shorter so I want you know them to be waisted my legs look longer the light blue jeans just like didn't do anything. I mean, you know when you put on jeans, it's like they fit, they're fine, but they don't do anything for you. Like they just didn't do anything for me. The two pairs of jeans I love the most are these ones from Urban Outfitters that I'm wearing, which are from like the BD something brand, and then the, these Levi's I always wear. I'll link to my favorite Levi's down below, and I'll link these if I can find them. They're like a limited kind of pair, but I'm trying to find them on Urban Outfitters. I'm like really picky about jeans. I feel like it's better to invest in one or two nice pairs of jeans than just have like meh ones, you know? Same with shorts. Like I literally, guys, own one pair of jean shorts. I'm not exaggerating because like none of them just fit me how I want. I'd rather have one pair that fits me like I know amazing and I can wear them than tons that don't. So the jeans I didn't really like. I love that cropped cream sweater with the two big pockets, but it just, I didn't know what I'd wear it with. Like my two decisions when I buy something is... Like basically, how how like what am I like am I gonna be able to do I love it is the first question I have to love it to buy it like before I, cause I when I was cleaning out my closet if you don't know like a few months ago I literally cleaned out like sixty to seventy percent of what I had and I only wanted to have the stuff I loved and I realized how much of the stuff I bought I was like oh this is nice but I didn't love it so now I'm trying to be like do I love it and if I don't have that immediate like I love this you know that feeling when like have you ever seen something like a bag or a pair of shoes you're like I need that like you have no doubt you're like I need that I need that like I don't care like I'm getting that like that's the feeling I've tried to go for and so that I didn't have that feel like I kind of had that feeling about that but then I was like okay so how am I going to wear it I like it to be really versatile for example like this black tank top also from Zara from a while ago I can wear like tucked into jeans, tucked into shorts, tucked into a skirt in the fall I could throw a jacket over it like I like to have things that I know I'm going to wear a lot so that's why I frequently buy black, white, and neutral colors so I can mix and match um, and that I was like I don't really think that sweater would have looked good with like light wash jeans it might have only looked good with like dark wash jeans and a casual shoe but I don't even really like that I wouldn't really wear that sweater with like jeans and like heels I wouldn't wear it with a skirt I don't know I just wasn't feeling that sweater let's get started with the haul um yeah basically like so. so the first top I loved it's just like such a nice top is this it looks like so it is just basically white and has these little ruffles in the front. It's like such a nice classic, classy piece, and I could see myself wearing it tucked into light wash jeans, tucked into dark wash jeans, tucked into shorts even, and with strappy heels. I just feel like this is really nice. It's a good piece if you just need to be like a little bit more wholesome for some sort of activity. Let's say you're going to a meeting where you don't really know the full, you know, vibe of the place, or you're, I don't know, there's like, I feel like it's always good to have those tops that you like I know are like safe nice like wholesome tops i think the frills are so feminine and nice and then the little it's like such a feminine top and then the little kind of detailing on the shoulders and then they frilly things right here this i got in a size small it comes in extra small small medium large and extra large and i like to go through that because some don't come in an extra small um, but i just got in a small to be a little bit looser this was 39.90 next i got a classic um just like black t-shirt and they come oversized this is a size small and this was 17.90 it's a really nice like thick material which is interesting it's a little bit distressed like it has like little cuts on the neck and it's really really long like I don't want to say it's like, going to be a t-shirt dress no I could I could definitely wear it though as a t-shirt dress if I wore shorts under it and then did like a strappy heel which I think could be really really cute as well during the day I also thought I could I could wear it like casually and just tie it in a knot and then wear it with leggings and some sort of athletic shoe I also thought I could wear it with light wash jeans dark wash jeans and like an athletic shoe even or like a, a casual shoe or even like I could wear this 
like light wash jeans and a black strappy heel. One of my favorite outfits is just do a blouse, some, a pair of pants or jeans, and then a, like a strappy heel. It's like the classic go-to look. It's pretty comfortable most of the time. It's easy, it's nice for daytime, and it can always be appropriate for evening time. And I never had a blouse actually that was like vertical stripes, and I saw this and I really loved it. It's also interesting because it looks like it dips pretty low, but then it has like a little... Um, kind of a clasp in the center. It's really comfy, it's like a light material. It still looks really dressy, obviously. It still looks like a blouse, but when you wear it, it feels like you're in a pajama, but you still look very trendy and stylish. Again, I figured I could wear this. You could already tell with like every single type of bottom it would be appropriate with. It's black and white, so it has lots of options. I think it's so pretty. I think that like this, with like black pants and black heels, maybe like a baby pink bag or something would be such a fun accent. And this was from their TRF collection. This I did get extra small because it was already kind of like loose fitting. And then this was $35.90. I love having tons of different white style blouses. I don't know, like there's like one of my favorite things. I have so many white blouses, not so many, but like five or six, which to me is like of one exact piece is a lot. But every time I see one that I love and fits me well, I pick up another one. Like, I just feel like you cannot have too many white blouses because you just can wear it with everything. Like, you can wear them with shorts. It looks classy but fun. You can wear it with, like, shimmery pants. Like, you know what I mean? Like, like faux leather pants and it's, like, so cool. You can wear it with just, like, ripped jeans and it's, like, edgy but classic. You can wear dark wash pants and a black trappy heel and it's chill. It's amazing. So I picked up this one. It definitely needs to be steamed because the, the way it got, like, crushed in the bag is a little rough. But the, I love the little detailing it has. Like, it has these... I mean, they're plastic. They look like stone kind of like um, securings on the sleeve, which I just think is like details like this. I really enjoy. It has that same one up in the collar. I definitely not, would not have it buttoned like that. I have it kind of like unbuttoned. I'd probably wear like a black lacy bra under it or something like that. And then this, it goes pretty long, so it's like oversized. So I picked this up in a small, and this was $45.90. A little bit on the higher pricey end, but it's a very thick material. I don't think, I mean, I'm sure you can tell, like it's, I need, it needs to be ironed, but it's really thick. It almost looks like silky. I don't know if it's silk, but um, the material quality looks thick and nice and substantial is the word I'm looking for. So I know I'll wear this a lot in the summer. It's, it's like a piece you can wear year, year round. You can wear it in the summer easily. In the fall, it'll be, it'll be super easy for me to throw on a jacket over this. In the winter, it'll be nice to throw. I can throw a thicker jacket over it, like or like a long, you know what I mean, kind of jacket. Back in the spring, I can bring it back out again. Just a very versatile piece. Because I was playing with it too much, so I just put it all to one side. But this is... I just think that like thin straps like this are so beautiful and elegant and like I picture this in the evening time like at dinner with flash anyone else see that already and I'd probably wear this with some sort of pant honestly like you could wear it with any type of pant you could wear it with jean shorts it might be a little, like it might be a weird combination but I can definitely see myself in this with some like dark wash pants a black strappy heel and a bag and it's like so like light like you're literally in a tank top and jeans but you look so dressy and so elegant and it's just like so pretty i feel like with like a white pant or a white skirt i just love this color red and i love silk i just think it's like such i just think it's like a really sexy piece and i was like i need to have this i know i'm gonna wear it a lot these shoes from zara and i was like i need to have these like i need these in my life um i talk a lot, I talk a lot about trying out like i talk about investing in nice quality shoes which i have talked about before about how it's like i'd rather spend like on um a higher end brand and then have them last at a cheaper brand but i do like to buy a cheaper version of certain ones to try them out before i get the full cost version for example i would wear those zara platforms sorry i'm playing with my hair you know when you have days where you're like i don't even know i wore those zara platforms a ton before i picked them up in like the gucci shoe and like yeezy has similar ones like this but i don't feel like there's even gonna be a material difference the thing is about like getting a cheaper shoe versus a designer shoe there's usually a substantial difference in quality i'm just wondering if anyone has yeezys or like is like this clear acrylic really gonna be better on the Yeezy? Like, do you know what I mean? I don't know. Like, I, I really need to see how I feel about that. But I love these so much. They have silver detailing, which is fun. I actually wanted a shoe with silver detailing because all my shoes have gold detailing. Every single one, except for like, yeah, every single one I have have silver de have gold detailing. Maybe except for two, but the ones I commonly wear, I'll have gold detailing because it matches most of my bags. But if I wanted to wear a bag that has silver detailing on it, I wanted to have a shoe that I could wear with that and a shoe that's like really versatile. This is just has like a clear heel, the silver on the side, and then like already like oh, so it's our shoes like it already looks like it's like peeling a little. Like I'm gonna put like super glue or something. Um, but it's like clear straps and then it like wraps around around your leg. I just think these are so cool. They'll be cool to wear with like I I could see myself during the day wearing a white. Um, a white tank top, white t-shirt, like ripped jeans, high waisted jeans, and then these, and it's just like cool and fun and edgy. Lastly, but not least, oh, two more things. 
too yeah i got this cape which i'm so excited to wear like i'm so excited for the fall time i actually really really love summer but for some reason i'm just like already excited for it to be cozy and like i don't know it's just black i might get a hem to be shorter i'm really not sure um this is an extra small and this was 99.90 it's obviously a heavier outerwear piece that's why it's from the trf line but it's just like really classic it has like these sleeves folded over like this um it has the pocket like this like these really nice pockets has a collar like it looks like collared around if you can see it's super classy it's just a really classy piece it's really really long as well i actually will try this on just so you can see what it looks like all right i don't know if i should try it on in the dressing room but i'll show you what it looks like on i think in the fall like i would wear this black tank top i would wear like black full full, full leather pants a black strappy heel and then have this over and it would just be like so classic and cool so i got that and I got a tank top that I really, really like. It's just kind of basic, but it was really interesting. And I also thought I'd wear it a lot. Had the strappy straps that I love that look really nice quality. And it was basically like a typical V tank top, but it just has this like lace kind of like directly layered over it. And I just really like that. I have a tank top that's like this and black that I wear a ton. And I was like, this is just like so nice. Like I could even wear this right now with the jeans I'm wearing and then just literally put on black strappy heels. And it's an outfit. And if it was fall time, I could literally just put on those pants, black strappy heels. And then this cape, and then immediately it's like a sultry evening type of thing. I could also wear this with a skirt. I could wear this with a lot of stuff. And this comes in a small, medium, large, or extra large. This is $25.90. It's a little bit pricier, but the lace goes like throughout the entire shirt, if you can tell. Like literally the entire shirt. So I figured it's pretty nice quality, and it's pretty substantial. Like it has like two little things back here. I don't know. I just, this I really, really liked. I thought it was unique, and I think it looks really expensive. Like just from looking at it, like if you just sold it at a boutique. So I figured it was worth it. That was all the pieces I got. I will link what I can find for you, obviously, of course, on Zara, as I always do. Let me know if you like this video. If you like these Shop With Me style videos, give me a thumbs up, and I will definitely do more. I could do them at different stores. I could do one, like, at Target, or I could do one at the stores that you want to see. So let me know the stores that you want to see. Like I said, I really want to still want to do one at Victoria's Secret. I'd love to just, like, take... Yeah, I'd like so many places I'd love to, like, take you. What other stores do I feel like I like to go in a lot? Um, I could even always see them at makeup stores, but it's not as fun as like trying the stuff on. Um, but yeah, or could you like Nordstrom or something of that nature. So let me know if you're interested in that. I love you guys so, so, so much. I hope you guys enjoy this shop with me video. Feel free to subscribe and put the post notifications on. Clyde has new 24 karat gold necklaces out. And I always post on my vlog channel if you want to see more lifestyle stuff. That's basically all I have to say before my tangent is over. Um, I love sharing this stuff with you guys and I hope you love it too. And I will see you so soon.